was the Mikawa Flower Festival. Huh? What's a human doing here? We erected the barrier, didn't we? Ugh, what a pain. The yokai at the festival began discussing how to drive away the human. Huh? When suddenly, they heard a voice. Oh. Oh. Ah. This is our festival. And the point is to have fun. What difference does it make if a human joins us yokai? <laughs> the speaker appeared to be a prominent figure among the yokai. And when he spoke, the other yokai fell silent. You there, young man. Do you drink sake? Yes, I do. Ah, then join us! We can enjoy tonight's festivities together! <laughs> and so, the yokai and samurai celebrated together. The two competed in the highlight of the festival, the Akitsu Hazara. Their spectacular game ended in a draw, and a new friendship was forged. <laughs> I can't believe a human could keep up with me! Witnessing the dynamic powers of the yokai will certainly help hone my swordsmanship. You're a swordsman? Oh, yes. I'm currently traveling the world in search of formidable opponents. Then let's make a deal. We meet for a duel every ten years. What do you say? Hmm. I look forward to it. I was about 25 years old when they met at the festival. They met again ten years later and remained friends. They spent time together drinking, traveling, and sparring. When they had first met, they merely respected each other. But ten years later, they became best friends. After another decade, the samurai had reached the pinnacle of his swordsmanship and won their duel by a narrow margin. Kamai was so astonished by his defeat, he gave up drinking and began training to become stronger for their next duel. However, another ten years later, Kamai did not meet the samurai. As it turned out, war had broken out in the south, and the samurai had gone to defend the border. Kamai was unconcerned, because ten years was nothing in a yokai's lifetime. But when they met once again, Kamai discovered that the samurai was already 65 years old. He couldn't believe his eyes when he saw the samurai's gray hair and scars covering his body. Hey, old friend. Can you still wield the sword? <sighs> I'm getting too old to fight. <sighs> this time, I've come to say goodbye. I see. Then, how about one last game of Akitsu Hazara? <sighs> All right. The samurai gave his best effort during the game, but had to quit halfway through because he was too weak. After putting down his agoita, Kamai remained silent for a long time before letting out a long sigh. <sighs> what a shame.